A nine-year-old girl from Flagler County is stuck in a hospital bed right now, away from her family fighting COVID. Her parents say they did everything right, and they're calling out the school district for what they call lax mask policies. Yeah, the parents say the problem, the Flagler School District does not have a mandatory mask policy. Fox 35's Vicki Carr has the story. It's what Tristan Simon had feared. You think it's not going to be your kid? <laughs> it can never be your kid, but... It can be, and, it, and, it, and, and now it's mine. COVID-19 infected his entire family. It started with his 14-year-old daughter, who despite being vaccinated, became a breakthrough case. Then him, his wife, and all his children. They had mild symptoms, and things appeared to be back to normal, until his nine-year-old daughter, McKenna, ended up in the hospital. We're well aware that vaccines protect us from getting severely ill, but our nine-year-old can't do that. They don't have that option. Here she is in the orange swimsuit with her twin sister. She has been in a Jacksonville hospital for the last six days, initially dependent on oxygen, and doctors have worked to keep her out of the adult ICU. Her dad says things are now starting to look up. Today's like literally the best day of our lives, knowing that she's you know, made this turn because we didn't think it was ever going to come. So, I mean, we, we were dancing in the hallway. He hopes sharing McKenna's story changes minds when it comes to safety precautions like mask wearing, social distancing, and letting parents know their kids may not be as safe as they think. My kid was healthy. She takes her vitamins. She's a normal weight. She's, you know, she's got no underlying conditions. Yet here we are six days with my daughter strapped to a wall, not being able to move more than three feet at a time. With their life now turned upside down, a relative created this GoFundMe page to help with medical expenses and alleviate some stress off the family. My kids are calling me on a daily basis. When are you coming home? When are you coming home? And I'm like, I don't know. In Flagler County, Vicki Carr, Fox 35 News.